So you want to scan for stocks that had a MACD crossover today. Well, if you go into the Scan tab in Thinkorswim, go over to the Creation tab here, the hamburger button that's associated with the, tan, the scan. And we're going to go to Load Scan Query. Load Scan Query, hard to catch it. And we're going to go to Create Scan Query. And now give your new scan a name. We'll call it MACD Crosses. Call it long. Okay. And we will create our study. Let's delete these default studies. We're going to apply a study. In the study name, we're going to say in the drop down custom. All right. And that will bring up a coding window we can use. We'll click on the Think Script Editor tab. And now we'll put in our code to scan for these MACDs. And you just have to say MACD. And then you have to give it the short and the long uh, parameters. If you don't do that, it'll go with the 18, uh, 26, 13 uh, MACD by default if you just put it in with no, no parameters. Uh, for this exercise, we'll do the 3, 6 uh, parameter. We'll do like a 9 period moving average. So we want to pick the, the, the place where the, the value has just crossed the signal line. So we're going to say dot, double quotes, value is is greater than D369 average a, 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 B, G. okay it accepts that so that will give us all the stocks that have a MACD value greater than the signal line at the current period which is the current days candlestick bar and it's it's set to do day by default but you can change the aggregation level here if you want to, to go to something other than days, day charts, you can do, you know, weekly, monthly, five minutes, et cetera. Uh, but to finish the code, we have to say that, okay, so the current point is greater than the signal line. Let's copy it. And we want the prior point to be less than the signal line. So we're going to say the MACD369 value from one bars ago is less than the MACD signal line, the average from one bars ago. Okay, it accepts that. So we hit OK and we save it. We go into our scanner, hamburger button, go to load scan query. It should be under personal. MACD crosses long. And we run that and we get all the stocks that have a MACD cross on, on this day on, on the 369 basis. And that's that's how you do it. Thank you.